Hi guys. I'm sure that many of you have one of these lying around. This is a uh, laptop mini PCI Express uh, Wi-Fi card. I'm sure you can see it. I don't know if this, this thing focuses right or not. Anyhow, the problem with these is that they don't fit into the regular uh, PCI Express slot uh, in your PC. So, in order to make them work, uh, you can buy one of these, which is a adapter for them from uh, eBay. Uh, this one cost about seven bucks. Uh, and it's quite useful and it works perfectly and we'll take one of these and turn them into a um, PCI Express wireless uh, internet card uh, it comes with two antennas already and this which is a cover a protection a heat protection of some sort for the card itself for the adapter um, well let's see how it looks put together and voila, this is the finished product. Not much to it, just connecting the wires to these two points over here. Um, remember to keep one of these screws. Uh, it's exactly the same as the one that came in your laptop, uh, the two holding screws, because the slot has some kind of spring that pushes the card upwards. And uh, without one of these, it's not going to stick. And it's not for sure that it's going to come supplied with uh, the adapter. Mine did, so it's a fair chance that you will have one as well. But just in just in case. Um, so I'm just going to pop it in the computer and let's just see how it holds uh, its own. I've placed it inside the PC. As you can see, it's very small and... Therefore, you can uh, fit it in a very small form case PC or whatever you have. And it's not going to take up much space or bother you in any way or anything else. Put underneath or above it. As you might see, it has a video card right above the, the slot it's in. And there's no issues. Even has some uh, clearance room. Uh, at the back, well, I do have some issues with the antennas because the video card is above. And... They kind of um, hit uh, the connection, but this might not be an issue for anybody. Uh, I'm not going to bother me. It's just an aesthetic thing and, uh, well, I just have to move them around so <laughs> they can fit. This is not the position this PC is going to stand in. This is just a browsing PC. It would be put <coughs> in my grandma's house, if you can believe it. Um, okay. Uh, that being said, this is uh, the speed test that comes from my internet provider. Um, let's see how it fares. So not bad, it's at 100 megabytes per second, uh, 105 stable download speed, 106, wow, it's probably at the limit at, of uh, this uh, Wi-Fi adapter, I don't think it can go uh, anymore. It certainly didn't go this fast in the laptop. Remember the laptop antennas are somewhere in the monitor, um, in the display case, so probably weaker than the ones that you can attach to one of these. I think, I'm not, I'm not sure. The thing is, it went uh, at about 98 or 99 megabytes per second download speed when it was in the laptop. And let's see the upload. Well, the, uh, the upload is fine as well. In the mid 80s, which is fine by me. So there you go. Um, I just had it lying around uh, the adapter, I mean, and I had no use for it. As I turn my, uh, uh, it didn't have a Bluetooth uh, adapter thingy in it, and um, well, I just got one with the Bluetooth and uh, faster speed. Because I have a gigabyte 
or whatever you call it connection um, high speed connection over the internet so this one became obsolete had it put away I mean I didn't want to just throw it and so another video with some guy using one of these thought I would give it a shot I mean five dollars seven dollars is not so much of a uh, of a pain in the budget so very pleased with my investment had to show you guys maybe save you some room and some wires and get one of these to work again I mean just sitting around getting dust or being thrown away is not not very practical okay I hope you find my my video useful in some way I'm sure it's not quite educational but I'm sure he pointed out some things to you and uh, good night